In this Getting Started video, we're going to walk through creating a big value. After you've run a successful query, click the green Add Chart button at the top of your SQL results or the new chart icon above the SQL editor. Open up the chart menu and select Big Value. To start configuring your big value, pick the field from your dataset that you'd like to visualize and drag this pill under Value. By default, a sum aggregation is applied. This sums all the values in that field across the entire dataset and displays that number as the big value. You can change the aggregate type by clicking on the pill's context menu dropdown. In this example, let's look at average transaction. Now let's imagine we wanted to understand more recent transactions. To group your dataset, you'll need to drag a field under Trend By. You can think of this field as the x-axis on a line chart. In our example, we want to group the data by when the transaction occurred. After dropping occurred at under Trend By, the big value will update to show the last value in the dataset as opposed to the aggregate. This value will also appear at the bottom of your chart's data, which in this example represents the most recently occurring transaction. You'll also notice that you can now drag a field under Indicator. If you drag the same field here as what you have under Value, we'll calculate the percent difference between the big value and the previous value. In this case, we'll compare the data with the previous year. The Indicator's icon and color reveals the direction of the change. You can customize the color palette of this indicator by selecting a different divergent palette here. In the context menu of the indicator pill, you can change the comparison from the previous value to the first value. Let's imagine we wanted to compare our transaction data to the first year of transaction data captured rather than the previous. You can also change the calculation that gets performed to difference rather than percent difference, which will display the raw amount as opposed to a percentage. If you don't need a calculation applied to the field you've dropped, choose Don't Perform Calculation. It's time to go big or go home. Create a big value today!